guys, if you're just joining us, welcome to the Tekken World Tour Master Event here at the Mix-Up Leon, the final Season 1 tournament ever. This is going to be crazy. Who is going to take it? Right now, we have a crazy match. Yes. UYU match right here. Yes. UYU Kudans versus UYU John Ding. Yes, it's a team kill, unfortunately. Never like to see this kind of stuff in a tournament, but when you're in this top eight, it's unavoidable. It is. It's it's going to happen sometime. It's going to happen at some point, man. But, you know, John Ding has been, he's like Mr. Worldwide right now. He's been going everywhere. I was chilling with him in New York City a few days ago as well. And now we're here, both in front. Yeah. It's, it's madness right now. He's been performing so well. He just finished a top three finish at Summer Jam. Um, and, you know, he's had, he's got wins under the belt as well. Really, really strong player. But, you know, we all know Kudans. Yeah. On his day. What can he do, Bobs? That's what I'm saying. Kudans is such, like you said, on his day. Sometimes he can just play so clean, so untouchable. So fresh, so clean. But then there's sometimes Kudans, it ha it has to, you have to get Kudans on point, Kudans, where his electrics, his punishments, like yesterday we were talking about this, yeah. this morning with the Ru Kang match for the Hell Suites. He was blocking the Hell Suites, but he wasn't getting the electric punish. Yeah. He was going, hitting it with down 4-2s. That is not on point Kudans. Yeah. On point Kudans. And on point Kudans, we saw versus Low Hive uh, in, in a previous tournament. The way he was able to dismantle our EVO champion and destroy him yeah. and move into Grand Fight. I mean, on point Kudans is wow. scary. Are we going to get that today? Let's go. Kudans versus John Ding. There we go. A Devil Jin, I want to say, is one of the better missioners against Eddie. One of the better ones? Yeah. Why is that? Because of the back four. Back four. That's definitely going to hit him out of relax on the floor. And if Eddie presses a button sometimes, it's going to count on him and he's going to get a full combo. Yeah, we saw earlier yesterday we had Equinox Dimeback going up against John Ding. Dimeback took it quite convincingly with the Asuka Asuka matchup, but John Ding now in top eight because he beat him off stream. Yeah. Got that revenge. So even when the cards are stacked against John Ding, he knows how to win. Oh, nice sidestep showing Ooh. that he knows the matchup there. Yes, Eddie, you want to sidestep that right? Yeah, definitely. And what punish as well. I think we got on point food answer there. Oh, it's a bit too early to tell Bubsy. Don't commentate a cursing. Okay. <laughs> okay. okay, he's been to the throw though. <laughs> he's an electric. I'm back too. Can yeah. get a punish on that while standing one free, right? No, but it leaves him in crouch, so he's gonna go over. Oh, yeah. Oh, see, I didn't know that. Yeah, so so, so Eddie does. There we go. Oh, like that's definitely said, gonna get it. <laughs> does a lot of damage. He's probably gonna find the warhead too. Oh god. Uh, uh. Uh, boom! Look at the damage from that 13 frame while standing launcher. Oh, he's gonna get a punish. Yeah, while standing one free. Perfect punish. A one four sorry. Nice. Uses the crouch as free. Yep. And Eddie is so good at closing rounds as well, that down four so good. But yeah, like I said, the Wild Sunny one it is a high. So stuff like Dragonov's down two and other lows that leave him in crouch, it won't punish. Yeah, nice pick up there from Qdan. Wavu, wavu! Oh gosh, now this is a scary situation for Eddie because his sidestep is not as great. Yeah, but he manages to get out of there though. Now he's put Qdan to the wall. The hell sweep though! Nice. Uh, uh. There you go. Look at that wall carry. Side safety plus four, not biting. Mix up time. Nice. Yeah. Rave drive, here we oh, go. Nice. Mix up time again. Oh, block. We got on point, Kudan. Yeah. That's yeah. it. It's confirmed, ladies and lads. Kudan looking on point. One more round to take the first match. Can you do it? Just chopping away at him. Now, you as an Eddie player, or a former Eddie player, yeah. what would you want to see John Ding do in this match? I would like to see him use a lot of side set 4. Uh, side set 4 is a great move to use against Mishimas because it, it, it's great because it beats electrics and it may even keep him out and hit him out of other moves. Yeah. Got to be careful though because of that up forward 4 from Devil Jin. Ooh, there we go. Like I said, right. the side step 4. Definitely want to be using it. He there we that. go. He's back dashing, showing them spaghetti legs. Yeah, boy. Ooh. What a break, man. Yeah, you look like, oh, here we go. Side step, three plus four. Yep. Gets a clean wall splat. Oh, oh it looks like the axis kind of changed as well. Yep. Good punish. And this may be it. It goes to a rage drive. Or rage off, sorry. The broken plates are finish it off. Kudan's 1 0. -oh. Kudan doesn't look happy, huh? Because I'm sure he knew that he could have gone for the rage off. He's like, yeah. He looked like, what know, do I do? Yeah. But either way, he got the uh, full max damage combo at the wall and went for the mix up, and it worked out for him. Yeah. John Ding. John Ding such a talented player. Look at um, the guy is in not only top eight for Tekken, top eight for Street Fighter yes. as well. This guy, guy is, is mad. It's mad. He's a record breaker. Like, he's the first person to ever do that. So he's in top eight for both um, yeah. Tekken and Street Fighter. Which, yeah, it's an amazing achievement for him. It is, it is. The guy is so, so talented. Showing he can be strong in multiple games. Yeah. Yeah. But Kudan, though, looking very comfortable here. But he has gone for Lucky Chloe, the girl who I think has got the most buffs in Season 2, mm. but this is Season 1. 
It definitely is. <laughs> so maybe he just fought with Devil Jin. I do think Devil Jin does handle um, Eddie quite when I say well, I think he's got the tools to deal with He's him. got stuff to deal and put yeah. it out of his options, yeah. But um, yeah, Lucky Chloe, we have a battle between apparently the low tier character and the highest tier character. So, I'm a, so up forward three from Lucky Chloe, high crushes. Yes. Will it go underneath an electric? Who knows, man? Electric's one of those. Electric, it's so funny. Who said this back in London? They said an electric is basically a mid that you can duck. <laughs> I can't. I remember someone saying that, but I yeah. can't remember who it was. Electrics are basically mids that you can. No, punch in the healthy, but gets a counter hit anyway. Okay, and go to the wall, yep. Yeah. Look at the damage here. Pancake flip. Oh, man. Plus frames. I like that. While running free. Ooh. Great space in there from Kudan. It looked like the Wow! Rocket. Look at the pop up from John Ding as well. Every time he wins the round, he's like, yes! He was doing that move, and it seemed like the last standing four was with him. From it Kudans. was from that yeah. range. You know, Lucky Chloe's low pokes, actually, just pokes in general, are slept on. Her pokes are pretty good, man. Her jab strings are amazing. Her damn back four, so many strings. Look at the damage as well. There we go, this is gonna go to the wall. Arcane, just short of it. Uh, 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 beat him down. I get slapped with them panda hands. <laughs> That he pops up again. popping off again. Damn, John Ding is popping off after every he round like he wins. He looks like a kid in a candy store. He looks like he's having so much fun. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they got two rounds up. Nice punish there while standing one four. Yeah, go to the back four. Wild up kick. Yeah, catches him coming in. And we're going to go to the wall. Okay, yeah. Uh, uh, flipping them pancake. Oh, no. Oh, boy, the oh my God. Look at the damage. Oh, my word. John Ding <laughs> with a pop off. That was super convincing from UIU John Ding. He looks at the crowd. He likes that. Wow, he's such an animated guy. He is actually a fan favorite here, I want to say. Yeah. Anywhere John Ding goes, it, it sounds, seems like he lights up the room. He does, man. He's a very animated player. We saw him do the poke chop rock back at Summer Jam as well. The crowd popped up. <laughs> I was in the, I was in the crowd when, there was, when he was doing that. I'm telling you. <laughs> His madness. Definitely very animated. Yeah. Fan favorite. Kudan's just looking chilled. Just looking... You know, look at him. Man he's is chilled. on job. He, like he's, he looks like that all the time, just near chilled. Okay. I got something for you. He's thinking hard, man. He's a he's an architect. So, damn, I thought he was gonna flip them pancakes at the wall, but jumped over. <laughs> wow. But anyway, we're going to the G Corp helipad at night. Yeah boy. As Steve would say, turn up this music. Turn up the ting. <laughs> turn up the ting. Let's go. Final match here again. Get caught, have we got uh He's gonna go to the wall. Back one for the big damage. I respect that. He didn't break the wall. Went to keep the Okazemi. Yep. Using that four, uh, that four back two. There you go. Wild standing two. He's gonna go to the wall and get a combo of his own. Okay. Back four. Oh, just catches him out the air. Yeah, side step four. Goes for the jabs. No duck on the string. Rushing one two again. Down. Dancing on him. Two step. <laughs> 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 He's, he's loving it. He's having so much fun. You wouldn't believe this is a top eight match. He's having so much fun. He's looking like a true lucky Chloe player right now, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Kudans has to do something to, uh, about this. He needs to finish this momentum. Nice punish. Oh, does he get the combo though? But back four and wake up. Double. Double. Yes. Tries to. So no electric there. Is Kudans feeling a bit flustered now? I don't know. Maybe John Ding, he's found his momentum. Oh my god, the movement is so on point, but the punishment is just yeah, lacking. I think there was a side switch there that yeah. happened. It kind of messed up, messed up two dance. Hey. Okay, down four. Okay, four, four, two, demon four. Goes to the slide. Goes to, ah, and goes to the mid kick on wake up there. Two dance, not as animated. <laughs> He's like, yeah, yeah. Yeah, a little, a little flick of the wrist. <laughs> <laughs> okay, poking away, poking away. Nice backdashing from Kudan. One, two. Again. Two one, steps. Two. Oh, that's a big whip, but Kudan probably didn't want to press the button because he knew he had power crush properties. Yeah, just caught him looking. Caddy roll into the low. Nice. Punish. Wow. Great combo, but messes up there. Plus frames. Go to the one pursuit. Broken. Good. Looking probably for that wall splat. Jab. Heavy got this. This is so dangerous here for Kudan's. Back to the wall. Plus frames. Uh oh. Did he press the button? I no, don't think so. Didn't. There we go now. One round away potentially for John Ding to take this. This is loser's bracket action as well, guys. So this is an elimination match. Just Pally rolling in his face. Wow. Nice. Oh my God. This, what is this John Ding? Flipping them pancakes. 
This is a different jump than we've seen here, boy. No, Chaps catch him in the back with a laser scraper. John Ding is having so much fun here. Kudan, this is loser's bracket, so Kudan will go home if he loses this, but he's not out just yet. No, oh, and there it is, the block on the hell sweep. And Kudan, you are you, Kudan, eliminated from the oh, tournament. We're not having oh, this mix oh, up oh. again. Come on, come on, guys. We are not having this mix up again. <laughs> wow. A perfect example of just how good you can play when you are enjoying yourself. He was so animated and smiling throughout the whole match. Yeah. Shout-outs wow. to you, why you, John Ding. He moves on in this loser bracket.